Greetings. In this video, we will demonstrate the technique of blind nasal intubation. Dr. Janil McLean will demonstrate the step-by-step -step approach to this technique while self-intubating. Since 2013, however, in a difficult airway algorithm by various airway societies, blind intubation technique have been replaced with the fiber optic or video laryngoscopy methods. Regardless, blind nasal intubation still remains important technique in low resource countries, as well as in emergent situation where fiber optic or video laryngoscope may not be immediately available or practical. For awake intubation, however, upper airway anesthesia is essential. The nasopharynx and oropharynx can be sprayed directly from the container of local anesthetic preparation. You can spray it using the McKenzie technique or spray it via a mucosal atomization device. But adding approximately 5 milliliters of 4% lidocaine to a nebulizer, then delivering it with oxygen for up to 30 minutes is a safe and non-invasive way to topicalize the airway all the way down to trachea. Now, nebulization of lidocaine also allows the topicalization of patients with limited mouth opening as well. Let's now watch the blind nasal intubation technique. For awake intubation, however, upper airway anesthesia is essential. The nasopharynx and oropharynx can be sprayed directly or using a McKinsey system. Uh, the use of spray devices containing 4% lidocaine or a nebulization device is extremely simple and effective. You just need a bit more time for the patients to breathe and then the entire airway can be anesthetized including the topicalization or anesthesia of the airway in patients with limited mouth opening as well. And that was the blind nasal intubation technique expertly performed by Dr. Janiel McLean. Feel free to post a comment or ask a question in the comment section and we'll do our best to answer. For instance, is this technique still relevant in your practice? And how do you anesthetize the airway for awake intubation? Also, do hit the bell icon to turn notifications so you don't miss the next addition to this topic, which is anesthesia of the airway. And make sure to subscribe so you don't miss Nysora's videos. Until next time.